Hi, Denise here from Heyday Dry Goods. I just wanted to pop on and show you a quick tutorial on how I made these super cute flower lollipops using all the supplies that you see here. I'm using a flower dye by Sizzix, some washi tape, felt, and of course our favorite lollipops. They make perfect gifts to add to your orders or even make a sweet little valentine for your kiddos or just a special friend. So stay tuned and I'll show you how I make them. All right, thanks for coming back. So for this tutorial, we're going to be using this Sizzix Big Dye by Eileen Hall, number 661108. It is a flower layer dye, so it has four different sizes here. And for this project on this dye, I just used the largest one and the smallest one in contrasting felt. I have a fuchsia color here and a baby pink. And what I like about this dye is that it already um, cuts out the little center hole. So it makes it super easy for this project. And again, I'm just using the little Dum Dum um, lollipops. You can buy a one pound bag for about three bucks at the grocery store. And it, this is probably the easiest tutorial ever. I probably didn't even need to make a video, but you know, it's always fun to kind of watch and see what people make. So you're just going to kind of stick it through that hole and you're going to shimmy it up. It's going to stretch out a little bit because we are using acrylic felt, but it's going to stay on there. You don't have a lot of move movement, so you don't need glue or anything like that. And then of course the second layer goes on kind of build up that flower. I mean, that looks cute just like it is. You can leave it just like that and go on your merry way, but I thought it would be cute to add a little washi tape leaf, so to speak. So um, this is just Scotch Impressions washi tape. I found this at Target. They have so many different patterns and colors in their little craft section at Target. So I'm probably about a three inch strip maybe. I don't measure. You're just gonna kind of stick it in the middle and stick it together. And it's nice to have like a smaller pair of scissors so you get a little bit more precise in there. And I'm just sort of like eyeballing it and making like a little leaf shape. It does not have to be perfect. If you wanna trace it out, draw it out, you can. I think we all know how to make a little leaf shape there. And clip off the end. And that is it. I mean, how easy is that? And how cute is that? I thought with Valentine's coming up, this would be a fun little um, tutorial to make with your kiddos. And they can give it to their friends as a little Valentine's treat. Or you can put them together as a little uh, bunch and give it as a gift, maybe for a teacher or a friend. Um, I did make another one here using all three flower layers that is in that die. And then instead of using the washi tape, I just used the little uh, fourth, sort of like, I don't know what you call that, like a little tri flower leaf pattern and it has the hole in it too and then I just added the fourth one there. So if you didn't want to do the washi tape, you can definitely do that. So here's my little berry box full of my flowers. Wouldn't that be a cute little gift to give to someone? So anyway, that's it. That is my tutorial on how to make flower lollipops. I hope you enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up and thanks for watching.